Hello, it's me, Robin, with Simple Food, Simple Life. No grocery haul for me today because I am out of money that I've allocated for food in my pantry. I've spent it all. And I even went a bit over. So, I have to shop at home. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, I've done a tentative... Um, meal plan or some meal ideas uh, for the upcoming week and um, I won't be doing any grocery hauls for the next for two weeks so until my month my new month starts in the middle of August <clears throat> so that's just the way it goes so no money for me <laughs> okay stick around and I will show you what my grocery haul is from my pantry in the basement and from the freezer and for what I have here in the house. Okay. Okie doke. I'm back from the grocery store in the basement. <laughs> <clears throat> no, really, I am. I, I literally went down there with um, some grocery bags and I brought up three grocery bags with um, most of these things in it. Some of these things were in my freezer up here in the kitchen. Um, but I want to show you what I brought, uh, what I have for my meals for um, this coming week or so. So I've got some broccoli here and I've got some shrimp and I do have some rice in my cabinet and I was thinking about making a shrimp and broccoli stir fry. Um, I've got some chicken strips, so I thought I could have that with a salad. I've got some brown surf sausage and some Italian bread loaf left, so I thought maybe French toast might be good for supper. I had to bring out my last pound of butter. This was in the freezer. I've got uh, chicken thighs and chicken legs. These are the chicken quarters I got for 69 cents a pound a couple weeks ago at Hy-Vee and I divided them. Uh, I brought up some potatoes, some garlic, and some onions um, because I really felt like some potato soup might taste really good. So I also brought up some of my shelf stable milk. Uh, from Dollar Tree. This is, um, I thought maybe a macaroni and cheese dinner with a, a foil pack of tuna would taste good. You see, this tuna. I thought maybe that might be good. Um, I'm out of sugar in my canister, so I pulled a bag of sugar from the pantry. Um, I might try that this this coming week since I have not had one of these before. I thought maybe I would try it. And um, oh, also I brought up a bag of frozen strawberries. These are, I believe these are sugared. I'm going to, well they might not be sugared. No, I don't know. I don't know. I don't remember. Um, because I was going to make some fruit circles. I thought that might taste good. And I'll show you the fresh stuff that I have to eat uh, from my refrigerator. Okay, these are the fresh uh, vegetables and a little fruit that I have available. I've got some iceberg lettuce left. I've got a couple of ears of corn left. Um, I've got some tomatoes from my little garden patch. And here's some ripe yellow pear tomatoes. I made this up this morning. Um, it's just cucumbers and onion in some vinegar. Salt and pepper, really good. I've got one apple and my daughter brought me a couple of oranges and this is the orange that is left. I've got a bag of banana peppers and some small bell peppers and these are from my vegetable patch as well. One more thing I want to show you. I do have uh, this partial bag of peas left that my older daughter brought me. This is from their garden. And I just want to show you 
this is what I got from the dozen years of corn that my neighbor gave me. Um, these two lovely bags of corn for the freezer. Now, I got that done this morning. Now, I love to do this when I get some corn in the summertime. I can't eat it all, certainly, but I like to um, blanch it, immerse it in ice water, scrape it off the cob, put it in the freezer, and it is delicious around Thanksgiving and Christmas. So it's really, really, really good. So I just wanted you to see that as well. Now, just one more thing. These are some of the meal ideas I came up with for the week. They're not engraved in stone menus. Uh, it's just some ideas I have of what I might like to eat this week. Um, the French toast and sausage, which I told you about. And I've got some bottled syrup that I was wanted to uh, use more of, use up. Uh, the potato soup, the salad, and chicken nuggets or the chicken strips. They're fine as well. Um, the shrimp broccoli stir fry with rice. A bologna wrap with cheese. I already had that for my lunch today. It was good. And mac and cheese with a tuna pack. Uh, I was thinking about a shrimp alfredo as well, but we'll see if I want to go to all that trouble. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I can do it. I might. And a salami cheese plate. In other words, um, it's just uh, some salami, which I do have, and uh, cheese and some... Um, um, Maybe some cherry tomatoes, or rather the, the yellow pear tomatoes, uh, some cucumbers, and some fruit. So it's very tasty. It makes a great, uh, easy, simple meal. And some crackers. So um, that's just a, couple, a few ideas I had, and I thought I would share this with you. Okay, that's my haul today. What do you think? <laughs> you have to let me know. Okay? All right, that's it for me today. I love you guys. You know I do. As always, you know that little is much when God is in it. Okay? All right. I love you. Let me know what you think in the comments. Shopping at home, my grocery store in the basement. I think I can do it because I can't spend any money for two weeks on food. Ooh, I can do it. All right. Love you guys. Let me know what you're up to. Bye-bye.